YouTube, welcome back to my daily. Like and subscribe. I'm bald now. But, um, I've had a very long day as is. I had a very long day yesterday. I'm pretty certain that I slept for 10 hours. Um, which is longer than I've slept in a very long time. And I really, I really think I could do it again tonight. Uh, slept for 10 hours. I had a 13 hour day yesterday with Stompy. Um, I got home today after finding out that my truck, the guy said it's either a $400 fix or it's a $5,000 fix and it's not the $400 one. And I said, okay, you didn't have to say it all like that, but whatever. Um, so I took my truck from one mechanic to another mechanic today. And uh, he's doing another diagnostic check, whatever, and hoping that it's some internal thing that he might have a fix for that's not replacing the entire transmission. Cause I don't then, I don't know what to do if I need to replace my transmission because- People pog, wow. Will Stompy B do any future diving stunts at no. Alvius since he was so good at it in the camping stream? Don't waste more than 3k on that. It's going to be at least 5. And I know that it would be dumb wow. to put 5k into a 2007 Ford F-150 that has had issues for years. I know it's not a good idea. But I, here's, okay, let's, ex let's talk through this whole thing. I had to explain death to my little sister yesterday because a lynx killed a snowshoe hare in our backyard. Oof. So, what was I saying? Oh, about the, about the truck. So, it is super wasteful for me to drive a truck that gets 12 to 13 miles per gallon. And that, that is what my truck gets. It is super wasteful. Uh, there's no reason that I should, because I drive every single day. Um, I drive a lot. So, it doesn't make sense for me to get the same truck, the same model. Um, my ideal car, because I do need to have a truck. Um, I, well, I need to have... Small truck, right, Ford Ranger, exactly. So I, my ideal car is like a Ford Ranger or like a fucking Toyota Tacoma or something really small, you know? Um, like, these are all too big. Like something this small, right? Or like this. I don't need anything bigger than this. Um, and this would be my, that would be my ideal. Right? Because I need a truck because I do I do buy feet all the time. So that's this is like my ideal, right? Something like a small truck. But that's a problem because I need something that can pull my two horse, that can pull my horse trailer. And the reason that I have my F-150 is it was the smallest thing that I could get at the time uh, that was capable of pulling my, my two horse. I have a two horse slant load. Um, so I need to have a truck that can pull that, but I only use my trailer. I haven't used my trailer since I moved here in like a year. I haven't moved it since I moved to Cerro here. Um, can a Tacoma pull a two horse? I thought Tacomas were really small. They can. This looks like a toy. Is this a joke? Is this a toy car? What the fuck is that? I hate it. <laughs> okay, um, anyway, maybe I should get a Tacoma then. If a Tacoma can pull a two horse and it's this small. But how much are Tacomas? Like 40? A new Tacoma? I don't need a new one though. How much could I get a used Tacoma for? 30? <laughs> That's so bad. Uh, trucks are so bad. If you're gonna spend 30 grand. I don't have the ability to spend more than 30 grand right now. I don't want this. It looks like a Lego. A Ford Bronco would be perfect for you. <laughs> Thank you. Um, a Raptor. Okay, that that is the op. That is the other direction. I'm looking. I want a smaller truck, not a Raptor. 
I do think raptors are sick, but it's so it's so wasteful for me to drive a raptor everywhere. Um, see what the mechanic says about my truck. Maybe there's a quicker fix than the first mechanic saw. And it'll be less than a grand to fix it. But I'm probably going to have to try to trade it in if they even want it. Hi, my name is Maiga. I was wondering, do you guys uh, have any desire to trade a 2007 Ford F-150 that can't go more than 30 miles per hour uh, for a anything at all? Probably going to say no. Miz offered to buy a new transmission, just get the new transmission. I don't even want, like, it's not a good idea to put a brand new transmission in that car. I do think that it's just a waste of, even the mechanic was like, don't do that. Not kidding about the budgie. Wouldn't eat anything after he was about six months old and we had to take him to the vet to get tube fed until one day he stole a piece of my maz sticks. Now he tells us which one he wants. Reaper is a badass. Man, that's so bad for your bird. That's so, I, you gotta figure out something that he'll, I mean, your bird, but that's bad. Sometimes it's just time to move on to a new vehicle. I have an emotional attachment to this truck. I don't usually get attached to things, like to objects like that. But this truck, I am attached to. I think it's because when I was severely depressed in college, I spent a lot of nights in it. I think. Like, I used to sleep parked outside my house in my truck. Because I, mostly because I didn't want my roommate to hear me crying, I think. That is so depressing. <laughs> but I would, I would just like sleep outside in my truck three to four, three to, sometimes even five nights a week, like three to five nights a week. And she thought I was just like at a friend's house or something, but I was just sleeping in my truck. So it became like a, a safe place for me, you know? Um, and I've, it's the only car I've ever driven to since I was 16. Uh, that's the car that I got when I got my license. Um, so I've been driving that since high school, uh, since I was 16. And I've taken it cross country a bunch of times. I've driven it to Colorado with my horse. Um, I've, I moved my horse and myself here, um, from California to Texas. I've driven it back to California. I've driven it back to Texas. Um, yeah, it's just been a lot. Yeah, Cal, I don't either. I actually, I didn't realize that because I, I don't have that for anything. And I didn't realize that until, um, until... My car was in the shop when I was here, or I had to get it towed in, and I didn't have it for like three days. I was just so stressed. And that is also something that's contributing to my anxiety. I hate not being able to get myself around. I hate having to ask people if I can use their car or if they can take me somewhere. Um, and just like not having my truck. It fucking stresses me out. So, use that one for Alveus then. That is something that my mom recommended. She was like, you could make the argument that Alveus needs a truck um, for picking up produce or for... Um, going to buy things or going to buy bags of feed and for using your horse trailer in case Stompy needs to be taken into a vet or something. So you could pay the five grand to get transmission and then donate the whole truck to Alveus and it'll sit there so it won't get run down as much because it won't get driven as much, but you'll still be able to use it to pull the trailer and then you can write it off and then you could buy a car. <clears throat> but I don't know if that's necessary. For all this. Toyota. Have you checked the Toyota Hilux? Honestly, I haven't done very much research because I'm still hoping that I'll be able to use my truck. <laughs> this is nice. I like this. That's fine. I would drive that. Yeah. Cool. Bizarre in the US. Oh, well. Never mind. I wasn't attached to it anyway. Nintendo was shot by skeleton.